guys another video um gonna do some reaps i'm gonna show you how i would recommend you guys to do your reaps not just throw everything at like oh i need is a better speed uh whatever slot and i'm just gonna throw everything at getting the best speed slot because it's probably not what you want to do for reaps at all you probably want to take this like a smart way to improve what your account needs that's where like in most cases it's actually i don't really recommend people to do your reaps unless you have specific targets in mind because you know your account or that person is actually gonna take like a few minutes check which runes you have check which units you have check which runes is your account lacking uh, what kind of potentials do you have that you can be upgrading and blah 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 so you actually need to take a minute rather than just slap everything at like the hp slot six hp slot fours and whatever so um this is how i would uh do it on like other accounts or also my own account well your my own account i pretty much know what i want but at some point like when i'm out of like re targets or i'm not sure this is also how i check that so today i'm at the account of well, I heart a ragdoll, he's also known as Daytune on Twitch, so at least he's not a Twitch streamer, but he's a Twitch viewer. Um, so yeah, how I do this mostly is using uh, Rune Optimizer. So I, I, I could go like in here and I could like check all individual runes and the units and blah blah, but that's, I don't, it's gonna take a way too much time he has some premium units that is for sure recto jaeger strongest combo out there right now pretty much so i could say like okay uh they have vampire runes let's try to like increase vampire runes something like that mm. i'm gonna do this a little different a little different so i'm gonna use the optimizer so as you guys know i like to use this um still sounding a little bit sick i guess <laughs> nose is getting clogged huh so, uh, what I think we can see here is Rakdos quite good runed, Vampire, Jaeger is quite good runed, Vampire, uh, a bunch of broken sets-ish, but that, that's not that big deal, like, I don't want to make this video, like, two hours long, so, what I actually want to check, like, I can check right away, like, what are the best runes on this account, so the best runes are... Mm, whole bunch of random things, couple of vampires, couple of nemesis, which kind of makes sense. In here, one violent rune, 30 speed, not bad. A uh, bunch of vampires, more, one more violent. I don't see too much violent, actually. Well, a bunch more violent, so... <laughs> you could check, for example, okay, so how good are, like, the, the will runes in this account? So, there's about six that are 100% efficient plus. Or uh, ten that are above a hundred uh, or above a hundred percent plus. This one is not even being used. <laughs> Always make sure that you use all your good runes. This is also a way. Like, um, let's say just a small tip. Let's say I want to find all good runes that I'm not using. You just put like everything on inventory and you unrune all units in RTA that you're not using. Just a small tip. And then you can check like, oh, okay, I'm not using like a couple of good runes. Like, oh, I'm not using this with five rune. Why I'm not using this with five rune? It's a good rune. Something like that. I'm hearing something weird. No, it's just me. <laughs> okay. Then violent. What do we have for violent? Oh, that's inventory violent. Make sure you always have to set good settings. So we only have about 19 runes violent, which are... I think we can up that. I think that, that that's my main goal. And also, like, I recommend it uh, to the owner of this account. Throw your best vampire runes on Jaeger and uh, make Ragdoll violent. So that's actually also what I'm currently going to aim for. But as he kind of said, like, I don't really have the good Vio runes to do it. So then it already makes it easy. Like, I got to up some Vios, right? So... Let's check like individual slot wise. So let's say slot two speeds. He has two. They're actually decent ish. Actually decent ish. Slot four crit damage. I see. I see a good one. This is definitely a good one with some grand potential over here. This one is not too bad. So this is probably not going to be the focus. We can check slot six attack. Slot six HP. This is pretty much how I go around, like, oh, like, 
right? Th this is the one. This is the one. It's not even one above a hundred. And this one wouldn't even fit. Well, it would fit on a ragdoll. And it has some grinding potential. It's not too bad. But I think we can get better on that. I think we can definitely... And it's... Having slot 6 Fios attacks is always good. He does have some HP as well. Okay. Then let's check. Does he actually have a potential? Because preferably you have like an innate slot. So if you say not... None, it will show all innates, but then it's showing like a whole bunch of unknowns, which could be legendaries, but probably are not according to those stats. And then we go for the quality and we set it to legendary. And we don't see too many runes in here. Hmm. <laughs> so this is the only one, and this is actually a used rune, so that's actually a good rune. It's actually a good rune. Or is it good? It's... Yeah, it has crit damage and uh, crit rate, so that's actually decent. How about if we say... Will. He has a legendary... Oh, he's probably still re-upping this, I guess. Okay, are we allowed to do ancient re-ups? <laughs> hmm... Is this a good rune that I would say? Yeah, actually, well, the rolls are... Yeah, double roll speed, single, and the other two. Yeah, this is actually decent. Hmm. Okay, so attack slot 6, we don't have any without innate. Let's see, without innate. We have a bunch, though. There's a bunch that we could do. Oh, that's Will, sorry. Let's go for Fio. Fio. Bunch without... This is a 5 star, you do not want to... <laughs> you do not want to do that for 5 star. Let's actually check if these unknowns, what they are in the game. Because some of these unknowns, you've got one on Sabrina, one on Chakram Dancer. They're actually really low in the stars, so... Probably the one on Sabrina is also. Yeah, Sabrina is probably hero or something. Yes, it is. Okay. Okay, what do we have for... HP. We have an HP slot 6 that's... Oh, that's still unknown. Whoops, my bad. Hmm. This Velagil rune, though, it's not too great. It's not too great. It's not that bad. Okay. Hmm. Let's compare it to, like, overall, like, rest of the accounts. Because this is the thing, like, actually finding good Rhea potentials is not that easy. Okay, slot 1 is actually quite terrible as well. There's, like, three runes that are above 100 for slot 1. For slot 3, it's it's 4, but it has some, like, higher, st uh, higher ones. And slot 5 also has, like, a bunch with also some higher. So slot 1 is actually kind of terrible. Okay, I think slot 1 is a decent one to start off with. Let's go for another one. Legendary. Let's just find something that's kind of garbage. That you... Okay, so I'm mainly aiming for resistance is good, Aki is good. I preferably don't go for crit rate, crit damage because you could actually get like high rolls in these. And since I'm working towards like a bruiser unit, like Rectal and that kind of stuff, that's it. It wouldn't be too bad if it would roll in high crit damage, high crit rate. So going for a resistance roll or something that's actually decent. So currently that rune is used on Amelia, but this is the terrible roll. This this is barely legendary. Wait, is it? Oh, this is five star. Oh. <laughs> I jinxed myself. It's a freaking five star. Okay, this rune is not used. It's right next to it. That's why it was so low. So this is a one in each. No, it's a double in the... No, this is pretty much overall terrible one. So this is a 5 resistance, do we have something more? I see a 7 resistance, but that rune is actually used. That rune is better than this current rune. I see a 1 with 3 Eki. There's not too many like um, runes that are decent, so I guess I'm gonna go for the one with the five resistance because it's also like lowest rate it's not being used 
I would opt to do this crit damage one as well. Poof, already have that rune. And let's do some reups. This is not a bad rune, but it has a lot more potential for what it could be. Okay, that's not getting any better. But uh, yeah, th this is pretty much like how I... 31 attack, that is a low quad roll there. That's straight up a low quad roll. So I guess I'm gonna keep that. Is it? Hmm. <laughs> it's already better than like pretty much efficiency wise. If you would jam out the accuracy and add in like HP, this is pretty much a crazy like high attack rune. Is it most efficient of what you were looking for? Uh, probably not, but I would say not a bad rune in general. Not a bad rune in general. And that's that's only two re -ups. That's the thing. Like, if you re up 1, 3, and 5s, don't go pure focus on uh, speed or, the, like, the stats you need. Take everything that looks decent. Like, as long as it's high as efficient, you can probably, like, it's... Uh, you can probably place it somewhere. Wait, there was this crit damage 1. Was it you? No, probably not. Okay, crit damage... And let's add this to include that. I think was it on one unit? And that's the, like this is the other one. That's the resistance one. But this I can actually deal with because it's high accuracy. You can probably place this somewhere if you enchant and grind this stuff. It should be around here. Somewhere. Yeah, how much crit damage was it? Was it this rune? Yeah, this rune. This rune is also not too great. You could add in like attack, but these are all kind of low-ish rules. I think you can easily get better than this. So let's do that. 17 speed, 17 resistance. Nah. That's not better. Like we don't want to add speed with the resistance. Don't add resistance. I'm not gonna drop like a whole bunch of them in there. Probably like 10 ish. Ooh, that's. Nope. Yeah, probably like until 60 or something. Nine. Oh, that's a thousand. A thousand flat HP. Like exactly a thousand. Nope. On my own account, I made a 37 Aki slot 3 uh, file. I'm like, what the hell? Like, if it was just, like, 37 HP or 37 defense, it would be used. But 37 Aki? What the fuck? Nope. Okay, the other rune went a lot better, like, straight off the bat. Mm, that's still not really what I'm looking for. Uh, this, though. This, though. Nah. Come on, something better. Okay, okay, five more, five more. We we got a lot of those. We, we got a lot of re though. So let's do five more. 21 speed. Okay, that's probably your fastest slot one. Right there. That's probably your fastest slot one. And you can remove crit rate, add in HP. That's, that's actually a nice room. That's... I'm not sure if it's your fastest, but that's a nice room. Going back to this one. And um, let's see. Was that actually your fastest slot one? Let's clear out you and clear out you. Fastest slot one, check. Check, his fastest slot one before was 19. So we made that to a 21, which is nice, which is nice. Okay, so I want to get back to the slot 6 attack. Because I feel like that's something... Could you throw this rune on a ragdoll and say like, hey, this can work? Yeah, I guess so. I guess so. <laughs> you don't really have an innate, but the slot six is your... It's doable to do without innate. So let's say... Let's see if there's actually some legendaries. Slot six attacks. 
Mm, no, he literally doesn't have any. I'm not gonna re-up this one. This one is already like... It's actually a hero rune. Or like it's a low trip. Well, like it's a low roll somewhere that it became hero. But it's a decent rune. It's a decent rune. Hmm. Slot 2 attack though. Which one slot 2 attacks? You don't need too many of those. You do not need too many of those. Well, we could do this one since it has an innate. We could like try, try like a, a bunch and just see where it goes. And then let's try like nine or something in this one. So wait, let me check where it is at. Because slot two attacks, you don't need too many, but the ones you have are actually really bad. Yeah, they're quite bad. Also, the the other one with the flat defense. I'm also I'm actually almost opting to go for the one with the flat defense because the stats on that one are even worse. The stats on that one are absolutely terrible. So the one with sub property of defense. Do you still have that? Yes. Yeah, this one. This one does not like. Preferably, you're not gonna re up things with a defense innate, but since it's slot 2, you probably don't even want a defense percent on it that bad. I'm not sure. Like, it's either this one or. The other one doesn't have defense, of course. Or it's this one. But this one is. It's not a great rune, but it's still usable. This rune is absolute trash as it is right now. So. Let's make it usable. Like, I'm not gonna say, like, I'm gonna, like, super overdo it, make him, like, the greatest rune ever. But I'm just gonna make it usable. That's that, that that's pretty much the gig right now. 16. Uh, nope. If there wasn't a roll in flat HP, then it would have been a lot better. This, however, is this bad? This is actually not too bad. It's not the best, but I was just saying like make this usable. And gem in speed, uh, grind up the HP, and it's it's a decent rune. It's totally usable. It's totally usable. So that's like for some runes, like you don't have to go for like the highest speed or the highest whatever stats. This already is like an overall valued good rune. So and this is just what you keep repeating of like checking into what rune, blah, 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 and that kind of stuff. So I'm gonna speed it up like a little bit of like, checking for which rune and then going to the next. Okay, so I, I got a new target and this one is gonna be interesting, but I would say, yeah, totally, totally do this. Because this rune, okay, is it your fastest rune? No, you have a bunch more that are like on the same speed ish. This rune is actually, actually garbage I would say because the roles are pretty much hero into how would you do it uh, I would do it on my account but I'm kind of like scared to do it on someone else's account because I would rehab this totally I'm not going to right now because it's actually your fastest rune but I would totally rehab this because this is actually a terrible uh, and pretty much unusable rune like you can grind in like HP or like you can grind in defense on this But then it's still like a really weird ass wonky not that great super high potential If you would re-up it fuck it. I'm gonna re-up this I, I can still keep the left one if it's not good Okay, that's keeping the left one. I'm gonna re-up this Sorry for your you people if you're like speed chasing and like 22 would be fine for you, but Okay, for this one, you actually kind of want to speed chase because it's a, it, that, that's the thing with like uh, slot 4 and slot 6, you kind of want to speed chase, right? Well, we're not getting any better on this one, huh? So you kind of want to speed chase still, but you want some decent substats as well or a way higher speed. So I'm not going to throw too many into these. I'm just two more, just two more. Well, this rune is cursed. This rune is cursed. Do not touch this rune ever again after this Ria. Okay, no touching this rune. No touching this rune. Yep, that's that's not what we want. That's not what we want. Okay, let, let, let's keep looking. So this one is not all too great. This is just overall like low-ish mid-rolls. Some resistance you don't need. 
reafton it. Mm, same thing, not that great. Nope, 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 nope. So what I'm looking here for uh, for this one, high overall stats and it's good. Uh, that's a low roll and a low roll. So, well, it's still better, but these are a bunch of low rolls. Well, crit rate. No, crit rate is supposedly 18. Speed is supposedly 18. Attack is supposedly 8. Um, you can jam in like HP here. You're going to need a bunch of HP gems. It's... Slot five, like I, I'm just making a whole bunch of runes like usable, but man, you're you're gonna be raiding for a while. Let, let's say that you're gonna be raiding for a while because these runes they're they're gonna need some raiding it's like to to fill up that. Let's check it for will. Like, how is the will? Now a lot of these runes I'm looking at, they're actually not bad. They just miss like they 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 look bad because they're not grinded. So raiding is important, guys. Raiding is really important. Also, most of the runes like slot 6, HPs, legendary, they're already all in use and they're actually not too bad. So it's difficult to say like, hey, I can just re-up this, so I can re-up that. This one, like overall it has terrible rolls, but it's still 16 speed. So yeah, I can use it. Yeah, you can use it, but you can also just throw some re-ups in it. Let's see if we can get this any better. Well, technically on the right, no, that's... If we would go all in crit rate and crit damage, I would have kept that one actually over the 16 speed. Because then it's like a really good Diana rune or something. So I'm not necessarily looking for anything that's over 16 speed. But I'm looking for something that's like overall more value. Um, With the crit rates... No. What crit damage that was. 15 speed, yeah, I would take this like over the left room any day of the week, right? Like the flat HP, sure, whatever, like you don't really need that. This is, it's a decent upgrade, like still like not the fastest room you want and blah, 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 but you can, well actually where's, where's the rolls at? Actually these are decent low rolls as well. Because speed is a triple roll, but yeah, no, no, I don't like this that much either. Let's keep on going. Some more resistance. No, because this is like a, this is pretty much a hero roll on the left. Uh, you don't need that much attack on this slot. Let's go until like 30. There's not too many re-up targets on this account that I really want to aim for. Uh, would I opt for more Aki, more resistance? Hmm. Hmm. Because the last slot is gonna be grinded out anyway, so I think this one is better then. Twenty-three. Uh nope. Let's go until thirty. I'm still not satisfied with it yet. Sure, you maybe don't want to re-up something with a defense innate because you want a defense uh, on this slot as well. But there's not too many re-up targets on this account, actually. That's, it's kind of lacking the re-up targets. It should be farming more, I guess, to match the re-ups. But you want me to do the re-ups? I'll do the re-ups. And to the best of my knowledge, of course. 15, 16, uh, no, the one on the left is still better. I'm going to do three more. I'm going to move on. Like, the, the rune is usable right now. The rune is totally usable. Mm, nope. Okay, usable rune on the left. Usable rune. Okay, let's keep on searching. It's actually not that easy to find something that I would say, like, damn, that's the one. Because the quality overall is kind of like, it's kind of like same style, same level, like, throughout the whole thing. And most of the runes, I would say, like, maybe re-up, they're already, like, grinded. So then I would say, like, ah, maybe not. 
Or not even like that. There's just not that many runes that are legendary and that have innates. Um, for the 1, 3, and 5. And then for the slot 6, uh, or 2, 4, 6, like the main stats that you're aiming for, there are also not that many targets. And then most of the targets already have like decent rune quality, like compared to the rest of the account. So that's why I would not opt to re up those then right away. Okay, so this account actually already has like quite decent slot 3s, but I'm gonna do more slot 3s because there's actually some runes with like decent potential in there. So, so for example, this one. Oh, this does not look legendary, man. <laughs> this does not look legendary. Yeah, the others are better, like they already have like high speeds and stuff like that. So let's throw in like five, let's make it like usable, like whatever it is, let's make it usable. Okay, one in each, I hate one in each the most because it completely ruins the potential of enchanting anything. High crit rate, high defense, some speed, a bit of low rolls throughout the board. I'm gonna try like three more. It's a usable rune, it's a usable rune, but... Bit of like low stats ish. 21 speed right over there. That's another 21 speed. Those are not bad 21 speeds actually. And it's it's a high roll, like high roll HP. Uh, yes, like semi high roll HP, semi double high roll on defense. That's that's a nice one. That's definitely a nice one. Um, what else? I, I'm getting more luck with the 1, th uh, 3, and 5s than with the 6, <laughs> apparently. But the 6 and 2s, there's there's just not too many, like, 2, 4, and 6 to actually do. Let me check if there's 4 HP. Okay, I have two runes here, and I have to max them first, but both of them, whatever they roll, they're gonna be absolute garbage. So, I think I'm gonna re both of them. Didn't you wish this would go any faster? Oh, this is always like, why can't you just be plus 12? Oh wow, it actually went quad roll into resistance. <laughs> quad freaking low on resistance. Okay, great. Let's re up this thing. Let's make this usable. To make this usable, you're gonna need some speed on the slot 4 HP. That's That's just how it is. You need some speed. A little bit more than four would be appreciated. Just just a little bit, like a tiny bit, tiny bit more. Twelve, well, it's already better, but I think when you you kind of need like eighteen ish speed still. That's that's kind of like the thing. Twenty two defense though. Twenty two defense. Eleven speed. I like this one more. I like this one more. I'm gonna throw in six more. Nope. These are actually on the left are quite high rolls. It's just not really what you're looking for on. Well, can you use this? Yeah, you can totally use this on like a tanky tree on or something. So yeah, I would say this is usable. Okay, let's go to the other rune. Uh, plus three completed. Plus six completed. Plus nine completed. Plus 12 completed. See, that's how fast it should go, right? Power of editing, huh? No, that's how fast it should go, like, normally. I pay mo I pay enough mana for that stuff. I don't care. Just make it go that fast. So, let's make this rune usable as well. Preferably a, more, a bit more speed than the last one, but still, high rolls is accepted. Except for when it's HP flat or any other flat stat. Well, speed is technically a flat stat, but hey, we need that one. That's the one we do need. 15 speed and kind of terrible rules at the side. Okay, five more, five more. Because of the 10 defense. Just because of the 10 defense. And then I'll do some one, one, three, and five for will the one it needs most, I think. Because Fio is already like 
also like kind of kind of I, I use most that were like looking decent okay that's that okay let's look at the wheel 135 and unfortunately the only wheel that's doable is the one that's not upgraded yet okay let's re-up this bad boy 17 cent uh, well it's better but it's it's not good enough not good enough that's not getting any better i was having high hopes for that one i was uh, like i was legitimately having high hopes for that one One on the right is better or worse, or better or worse. I think they're both kind of bad-ish. Rune efficiency wise, they're both terrible. Let's go for the attacker style. 22, some speed, no. Okay, let's finish the re-ups in this one. Unless it gets real good right now. Unless it gets real good right now. I'm gonna finish the re-ups into this one. Wow, that's actually oddly weird. You're missing a whole roll in this, so it's not that great. Do you want to keep this? Well, maybe you have a selective unit that you want to do this on. Like, maybe like uh, a Lucian, you just... Put like attack on it and it's usable i guess yeah that's it's not bad it's it's kind of selective forced focus but that's a quadro flat attack that's a quadro flat attack to end with well that was the session so uh okay let, let's recap the runes i did oh shit there were actually quite a bunch so i was unfortunately not able to Hit one of these runes. Uh, I made the fastest attack rune. So this is just to recap the runes. I made this rune. Uh, this rune. This rune is quite nice. Uh, where that? This rune was really nice. The one on Valagio. Um This one, the will rune. This one is decent. This one, like both of them are. I think this is more usable, but this is also not too bad. I think I'm missing out a few runes that I did, huh? Not sure. Why can't you select just by legendary, like straight off the bat? Well, well I kind of forgot. Like the uh, okay, so to back up the main runes that I upgraded, which were like quite good, so. We have the attack slot one, which was quite nice. We have the speed on this one, which was quite nice. Whoops. We have the speed on this one, which was quite nice. Then we have the will runes. This one is quite useful. This one is actually for like, uh, rolls wise, this is quite high. This could have been 14, 24, 12, but still decent. This is not that great. You can throw more into this one if you want. Same for... This one, where that's, where that's, this one, but this one is actually, this one could be used for like a lotion or something. It's not a bad rune either. Oh yeah, this is the other rune we made, so th this rune also has like quite some potential. This rune, uh, like, th th this is also uh, like a bruiserish rune, has some potential, and I think that's about it. Maybe I'm missing one or two. So that's about it for the video and thanks uh, Daytona for letting me play on your account, do your re-ups. There were like for 70 re-ups getting 221 speeds is actually, yeah, like doing, like we did like five or six decent runes in 70 re-ups, which is actually nice. And that's what you should like kind of aim for, like just get for these or go for the runes that are currently terrible and you can easily upgrade.
And that's why you don't really want to just throw like 150 re-ups in one rune and do not get like the 20 speed because hey, you're you're not always gonna get like two times 21 speed out of 70 re-ups, like for sure, not 100%. Um, I know a whole bunch of people that threw like 250 re-ups in one rune and still below 20 speed. So that's where it's kind of risky to go for the the, uh, the four and the sixes. But if you see your accounts actually lacking like some of the other runes, then you could easily go for the uh, one, three, and fives. Make sure you got the innates. Make sure you go for the runes that your account is lacking. Like, uh, let's say your slowest speed on slot one, slowest speed on slot three, slowest speed on slot five. Um, like either one of those three that are like the slowest. Wait, not the slowest speed on that slot, but yeah, the slowest speed on that slot across all of your runes. That's how I mean. Or you just the lowest efficiency runes on that slot, like throughout all of the slots. So that was it. And peace out.